Oh my gosh, look at these morning doves on my porch. Aren't they sweet? Hello, welcome back to the vlog. I am in the process of making a matcha latte for myself because I have rehearsal in about an hour. If you were wondering how we were doing with our espresso machine that we got in December, it is, we're obsessed with it. We're obsessed, we use it almost every day. I am a big proponent of like the evening, not evening, but the afternoon cortado. Um, but I usually am a cappuccino girl or a latte girl. And um, it's just, it's been fun. And we really, really, really like it. It was worth every penny. Clover is here. We went on a two mile walk today and he's got FOMO. Every time I get up and walk, he's getting up to walk, even though he should be sleeping and napping. My husband's on his way home, but I am leaving. <laughs> and so we will like, like ships crossing in the night. Um, so I have my first rehearsal today for Odyssey Opera. It's my first Odyssey Opera thing in like a year because Odyssey doesn't really do stuff every season. So they're just kind of like whenever the mood strikes, I guess. So we're doing The Voyage of Edgar Allan Poe by Dominic Argento. It's an interesting opera. I will say that I'm in the chorus. I don't have a role or anything, but it's our first rehearsal today. Um, I'm excited. I'm scared. I didn't get through the whole opera when I read through it this morning. I only got through seven scenes. So I'm going to be sight reading for the rest of the rehearsal, but that's, I'm not super stressed out about that. So um, I, I'm going to take the bus because parking in Harvard Square where the rehearsal is, is no, you can't park there for more than two hours without paying for a parking spot. And I'm not doing that. So I'm going to go ahead and take the bus. I think I have a few minutes to catch the bus. Yeah, I'm going to actually go right now. So <laughs> I will see you there. Good afternoon. I don't know why I'm talking to this microphone. This microphone's not on. It is Tuesday, almost noon. And I thought I would show you what how painful this is for me right now. <laughs> so after I'm still we're still like living, breathing and very excited about the St. Matthew Passion. It's like I haven't seen the recording yet, but we're like living and breathing in the aftermath after glow, I think is more appropriate. But like after the passion was over, the panic set in for the next concert, which is on the 17th of March and it's all French art songs. And sung French is different than spoken French. I don't speak French. <laughs> and I don't get paid to sing in French very much. So the, the pr practice of making my mouth make French sounds, long gone, long gone. That's been a lot, so I don't think, I think the last time I was actually paid to sing in French might have been a Christmas thing, but it wasn't, you know what? Anyway, it was a long time ago. And I'm sitting here going through the most painful, like trying to make my mouth, give my mouth an, enough muscle memory to do this and not sound like a complete idiot. Dire mon père et Mon père et ma mère. Um, I try not to do this on pitches, just so to, to get the whole, like... I mean, ideally, I would just speak the poem, but I don't... I don't get that time. I don't get that kind of time. The pianist and the lady who's running the concert, she's a... she's and she's doing all the vocal coaching as well. She's like everything. She's amazing, fabulous. But I don't want to go in like with, I want to go in with as few learned mistakes as possible. And sometimes she scares me a little bit. So there, a, a, a look into like what I'm doing here for like three hours today. And I just got a, um, a solo assignment at church this weekend, which is amazing. It's amazing because I've wanted another solo assignment at church and it's amazing because it's only like eight measures, I think. You know what, let me take a look. I'm lying, I may be lying. Two measures for the first one. <laughs> first little part of the solo, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten measures. Now listen, I'm okay with singing ten measures of music at church um, as a solo, because like, it's scary. It's scary, but it's fun. And it's Bach, so it's all good. All right. I mean, it's like it's like dipping your toe in the water. Dip toe in, 
So I don't like, you know, I don't need a whole aria right now, right now. Dipping toe in, loving that for me. Okay, I'm out of control, I need to stop. I will, I will get back to the French. This one survived too. There's a little bit of growth down at the bottom that doesn't look like weeds, so I'm gonna chop off all of this dead stuff and see if it comes back completely. So, yay for saving money on plants. <laughs> Mr. Bean found his way up here and is enjoying some time outside. Hello, Mr. Clover James. How are you doing? How are you doing, sweetheart? Are you enjoying your outdoor time? Yeah. a few days since I've talked with you. I am tired. <laughs> it's been an exciting, I guess, five or six days, but there's been a lot of performances and I just don't film it. <laughs> when I'm in the moment, I'm like, I'm at work and it's just like, I don't think to get out my camera and I'm like the worst vlogger ever. I'm actually parked um, in front of Boston Common right now. I just have to pass across the common tonight, or maybe I'll, I'll probably just walk around it, frankly. Or maybe I'll just go through, I don't know. Um, to go to rehearsal uh, for the second St. Matthew Passion, which, oh my gosh, I'm so excited to perform it again. It's just so fun to sing, and it's a great piece, and I'm having a great time. But I would be lying if I said I wasn't tired or if my voice wasn't tired. I am very, I'm quite tired. So, um, I'm just like trying to hold it all together and I feel bad because there's all these balls in the air, all these balls, and I can't catch them all. So, but at the same time, I recognize that we are blessed. We're staying blessed. So, 
tonight I have rehearsal at 7.30, which is in about an hour. And I don't know why I'm here so early. I think I just had to get out of the house. You know, I just had to get out of the house and chill. Course two is starting at seven. Course one is starting at 7.30. So, I mean, technically I'm here early. I could just sit in the common and vibe out for a little bit until it's time to go in. I might do that. Yeah. So, y'all have seen Boston Common before and the Public Garden before. So, enjoy it again for like the 80th time. <laughs> Good morning. We're going on a walk this morning. It's raining outside, so he's wearing boots. So I'm probably gonna wear just regular shoes, but it's just wet. It's not like raining, it's just wet. Anyway, good morning. Um, today we're gonna just do a day in the life vlog. So this is me. Good morning. It is Wednesday, March 27th. And today, <laughs> there's a lot of computer noises. Today we've got videos to film. Um, things to edit. I really want to get a video edited today because I've been like really dragging my heels on editing and I have rehearsal at night, which I don't know if we're going to sing full. We might just mark. Um, but uh, we got a lot of things to do today. Clover and I are going to go for a walk. We're going to play Pokemon Go on the walk, hopefully. And uh, we're going to get started hopefully around 11 a.m. Or I Okay, let's go. Feels like daydreaming, no I sit down, none. I love my life, sad, I change it, man. I ain't chumbo. The chemistry is a no with the two. And it all sits in my down, and I'm getting done. No. Okay, we're back from our walk. We went for about an hour. Played a lot of Pokemon Go on the walk. Pokemon Go is fun again for some reason. I don't know why. I'm having a great time. Just catching up on all the Pokemon. It's just fun again. So if you haven't opened Pokemon Go in a while, Open it up. Have some fun. Anyway, um, I've all showered, makeup, and all. Um, I really would like to finish the edit on this video, but first I'm gonna just chill for a little bit. Start the edit at noon. I'll grab some proteins from the fridge, put them in the so proteins from the freezer, put them in the fridge for the week. Um, I'm, I say the week, but it's really like Wednesday, so I'm like halfway through the week, and um, have another matcha. And we'll like ease into it, ease into the day. This is so, this is a lazy day. <sighs> so my week has not, my day has not been very exciting. I've been mostly in front of my computer. Right now I'm watching this figure skater that everyone's been talking about for the last couple days. Ilya uh, Malinin. I don't know if that's the correct pronunciation of his name, but oh my God. Like, if you have not seen his routine, Free skate. I don't know what it's called in figure skating, but watch it. He does like six perfect quad jumps and it's like, in, it's insane. So that was making me feel good. And I was filming and editing for like the last four hours. And now I have to go to rehearsal in like, uh, like 30 minutes. So. I am looking kind of greasy as well, so I'll just get freshened up a little bit and we'll head to uh, Cantata Singers and I'll see you later. This is probably going to just be a week vlog, but 
Um, I feel productive, but not really at the same time. It's kind of weird. Good morning. Well, it's almost afternoon. It's like five minutes till noon, but I'm just catching up on some drama channel stuff on my, on YouTube, and I'm going to have my brunch. We are having bacon. Oh my gosh, it looks so bright on camera. It, it's not this bright. It's like it's raining here and depressing. And some avocado toast with egg on top. It's I'm really looking forward to eating this because I'm really hungry. And um, we're going to catch up on some YouTube drama, and then I'll get to work. <laughs> Alright, I cleaned out some of my medicine cabinet. It doesn't look like much happened, but I think I'm ready for like some organizers for it because like this paper one can't stay in here because it's the bathroom and that's weird. But I've got everything into categories and you know what? It looks so much better than it used to. That's all like back stock in the back. Um, I might just get some opaque ones for that so I don't have to look at it, but everything else looks pretty good, so I'm excited. All of my all of my lotions and potions are here, and I even, like, I should have done this a day, a, like a day ago, because I just got cleansing oil, because I started wearing waterproof mascara a lot lately, and I didn't even know that I had an almost full container of cleansing oil. I hate that, because I was, like, using up all this pharmacy green clean, which actually I really liked, uh, it's almost done. That's how much is left in it, so it's like one or two more applications, I guess. Um, but you know, that works too. Also, don't look at the packaging, but this Good Jeans by Sunday Riley is so freaking good. Uh, this this packaging for this size is an actual scam. So here's the bottle it comes in. It's colored to look like there's product inside, but there's actually not product inside. Here's the product with the pump. The pump it's inside a little bag, so that is the product inside. It's it's really good. This is a lactic acid treatment to use at night, and it's oh, this makes my skin look so good. Along with the uh, the sleeping night oil, love it. But this, my friends, this is a whole scam, and I'm not here for this. So anyway, the Sephora sale is coming up really soon, so I'm gonna buy a full size of it. It's eighty-five dollars, I think, for a full size. So I don't want to pay eighty-five dollars. I want to get it on sale. But like this stuff is this stuff is legit. But I hate that they did this. That is just such a like what really. Happy Friday. It's Good Friday. So um, I'm sorry for the Roomba going in the background. It's in the bedroom just doing its thing. So just just ignore it. Um, I am getting trying to get ready for the Tenebrae service tonight. Normally Tenebrae is on Wednesday, but today's on Friday. I don't know what happened, but like it's not going to be live streamed, which like I'm kind of relieved about because I do have to sing the um, in the solo quartet. It means Ray Ray. And if you're not familiar with that, there are like five incredibly exposed and just high C's that I have to execute flawlessly. And I did it last year without really thinking about it because it was my first time doing it. And this year I feel like I have to like be more amazing. So I'm, I've got this whole like thing going on in my brain right now, which is not good. So it's two o'clock. I have to show up at six o'clock. So I've got a few hours to just relax. I'm going to look at the music really quick. I'm going to enjoy some vlogs, make a cappuccino, and hopefully that'll make me feel less scared. I have to leave today at five o'clock because I don't think, I have to report at 6.15, but I feel like the parking situation might be a little bit tricky today because it is Friday evening. Um... 
and I really don't want to spend money parking in the parking garage. So, because the parking garage is like $18, and to park in the street is like $4, so I'm going to try and get a street parking spot. Wish me luck. Anyway, it's cappuccino time. I'm going to enjoy some vlogs, watch some watch some of my music, no, look at some of my music, and then we'll uh, we'll go to Boston together. And uh, I don't know what I'm gonna wear, but it doesn't matter because I'm gonna be in the dark. It's Tenebrae. If you've never been to a Tenebrae service, it's actually really beautiful. Um, they have these all, it's really dark. They have these candles lit. And after a while, they start um, blowing out all the candles and eventually it's like super dark and really quiet. It's, it's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful service. Um, so like I don't need to put on like a lot of makeup because no one's going to see me and no one cares. Uh, Alright, cappuccino time. What kind of cappuccino to make? Maybe a matcha latte time. I think matcha latte feels much more like I need that right now in my life. <laughs> Okay, since I'm leaving the house momentarily, quick, how do I get the whole outfit in the mirror? Outfit of the day. This is, <laughs> I have to stand way back. Um, this is an over the, sh off the shoulder jumpsuit from E. Schottke. So um, it's like palazzo pants, which is so great because like as a short person, I can't like palazzo pants it really that, that much. There, can you see what it looks like? Well, you can see some of it. Anyway, it's cute. It's made of like a, like cotton, can you see it now? I'm like, there's a wall here. Anyway, it's from E. Shatke, and you can get these things made to your height. I'm not an E. Shatke, like partner or anything, but I am a fan. Now they did take almost three months to ship this to me and make it, but it's fabulous, so I can't complain. And they gave me like a, a $25 gift card. Oh my God, Clover, where are you going? What are you doing? What are you up to? You need to go outside or you need to go pee pee? Okay, I'll take you outside before I go, okay? Welcome back. I've cleaned up the kitchen and I have a like really small dishwashing load going because I'm too lazy to wash the ones that are in there and I just want to have them done but I'm like on the hour wash so hopefully they'll get clean. Anyway, it's about 8.30. Um, Tenebrae was great last night. It was so, 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 oh my God, it's such a beautiful service. Like, I don't know, I just love it. I love it so much. And it, uh, everything I think went really well as far as like music obligations are concerned. So I'm glad that I can provide 
the much needed high C's for the Allegri Miserere every year. So um, thank goodness for that. And so today, which is actually a really busy weekend. So it's Easter weekend. I don't know when I'm going to be posting this. I feel like I've been filming over the past like few weeks, but I don't know when I'm going to post this. I'm considering doing vlog every day in April just because I love the vlog every day grind, even though like it gets really hard like 15 days in. But so that means I have to post this either like tomorrow and start filming tomorrow or I could just post this as part of the vlog every day in April, Veda. Anyway, whatever I'm going to do. <laughs> I'm just going to hang out and do whatever. But um, so today it's again, it was, it's, it's Easter weekend. So today's Saturday. Uh, I have a, an opera rehearsal uh, at two o'clock. I have a parking reservation starting at 1.30, so I'll be there a little early. And then that goes until 5. And after that, I think I have to stop by the Whole Foods and grab things for Easter dinner tomorrow because then we're making rack of lamb. And I guess I need to make some sides. Um, but nothing too complicated. Maybe I'll grab some eggs. We'll do like deviled eggs. Um, <clears throat> but nothing too fancy. I'm not going to be fancy. But like I'd like to decorate a little bit for Easter maybe tomorrow. I may be too tired after rehearsal to do the decorating, but I might not be too tired to stop by and do the Whole Foods pickup. So um, I'll arrange that. I think I'm going to take Clover to the park right now, the dog park. My husband is um, hanging out with friends, and I think we're going to go to the dog park and get a little exercise in so that he is, like, not staring at me. Staring at me. This man always looks really bored upon waking up. He's like, okay, we're awake. What do we do now? Do you want to go dog park? Do you want to go play the ball at the, at the park? We can do that. I know you want to go play the ball at the park. That's your favorite. Thing. Don't look at the treats. <laughs> Don't look at, you're not getting those until you come back. He just got his little salmon supplement that he gets after every um, walk, and he is probably ready to take a nap, but he's, he looks like he's very thirsty. But he had a good time. He just suddenly wanted to leave, so I, I was like kind of worried that something was wrong with him, but he seems okay right now. Just very thirsty. He's all set this week with his pills and stuff, so I'm just going to refill these so that uh, I don't have to do it in two weeks. He's got one ready for next week, but I just do this um, every single, well, every two weeks almost. So he gets his Cushing's pill in the morning, and then he gets his fish oil supplement in the afternoon. I've already pre-wrapped a bunch of these. They're like wrapped in a bacon wrap thing, but they're tablets. Mm. All right, easy peasy lemon squeezy. Done. All right, I guess I'll get my workout in now. Um, so that'll be checked off. like years I've made shirred eggs so I'm very excited got some bacon on the side it 
I never trust that these are cooked. Anyway, I'm gonna enjoy these and then it's time for Odyssey, I guess. Let's do it. Hello. It is 1.30, 1.34. Oh my God, this thing keeps saying start my workout on my iPhone because I started my workout on my old phone because I was cleaning my current phone and now it's like all messed up. Can I close it? Can I close? I guess I can close it. Anyway, I'm in a parking garage in Back Bay in Boston and I have to drive through, well, I didn't have to, but I drove through like the Northeastern campus to come here and the, stu the students that walk on the street are so just nonchalant about crossing when they're not supposed to be crossing. They don't care if like you're a car or whatever. It's just like kind of ridiculous. Like if you're a pedestrian, you still have to like, you still can't just walk whenever. That aside, we are here 30 minutes early. So love that for us. I am, I always show up super early to things. I, I guarantee like there's a bunch of people here. Um, I, the weather today is actually pretty beautiful. It's windy, but the skies are clear because it's been raining for the last like four days and it's been super depressing, but all of a sudden it's like 57 degrees and look what I'm wearing. I hate spring in Boston. I like love and hate it because like this morning it was so cold. It was like 30 something and I was like, Brr! and now it's 57 degrees. So like, I don't know how to dress anymore. I have on a winter coat and a scarf. So I'm, I might be hot, but let's, uh, let's venture out onto the street and go to Huntington Theater, which is where we're having the rehearsal. I hope someone's gonna let us in because like, otherwise we, we gonna be standing in the street. seen Boston before. Welcome to Boston. This is the famous New England Conservatory of uh, Musax. Um, I have used to work here a long time ago and here is its very 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 beautiful concert hall called Jordan Hall. This hall is rented by a number of uh, organizations including uh, some of the ones that I sing in because it's so beautiful. Um, so but like here is what's going on. I guess we did an opera. Oh, Boston Early Music Festival, word. All right, look at this. Nice, 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 nice. Anyway, here's what the entrance looks like. Super pretty, very nice. Ooh, I think that mural is new. Very cool, that's what Jordan Hall looks like on the inside. Is the sky not gorgeous? Like, look at the sky today. It is out of this world so pretty today. But it is really windy. I don't even know if you can hear me, but it's super, super windy. Guys, this, this ensemble, A Far Cry, they're so good. Some of my good friends be playing in this group. Very, very good. Check them out online. Just a gorgeous day. So that over there is Science Mother Church. Um, it's massive, absolutely massive. There's a beautiful um, uh, pool in front of it. What's, what's it called? Reflection pool. Really, really gorgeous. I don't know what that is actually. That's that's new. Here today, very fun. New home, new vision, new era. Yay! It's open. Is it open? It's open.
have to work out tomorrow. So that's good. <laughs> I don't have to practice. Well, I should practice for opera rehearsal on Monday, but I can practice Monday. So I'm excited to have a whole day just to do like domestic things and like chill out a little bit, maybe play some video games. I don't know, but I think, I think it's time to brave the grocery store. Are we gonna do it? I don't know. We'll see how I feel when I get close to it. So, um, but anyway, we're gonna get out of here. No bike coming. We're gonna get out of here and we're gonna get on the road. I'm gonna listen to a couple YouTube videos on the way. God, I hate this parking lot. Like, you're so close to so many cars in here. Welcome to like urban parking, am I right? Am I right? Anyway, it, it continues to be gorgeous and sunny outside. I don't know where I live anymore. It's like five minutes ago, it was cold and now it's like spring. Hello, it's the next day. Happy Easter. Um, you won't be seeing this on Easter, but it is Easter when I'm filming this little portion. I'm gonna close the video here because I don't know what this vlog is, but I have to say that um, I went to bed at 8.30 last night just because of all of the, like, the closeness of the rehearsals and performances, just I needed some sleep, so I feel good today. It's about shortly before noon, and I'm gonna get ready for Easter dinner, because I'm making Easter dinner today. Um, my mother-in-law's gonna come and enjoy it with us, so it's a beautiful Easter day. So today I'm gonna spend the day doing a little bit of cleaning and prep for Easter, and I'm gonna make that a separate vlog. So I'm gonna attempt to do vlog every day in April. We'll see how it turns out. I'm just gonna be really chill about it. If like I can't upload, I can't upload. No biggie. Um, but I feel like I've, d I've done VEDA twice before, I think. And one time I think I was successful and another time I got sick in the middle of it or like on the 21st or whatever so I couldn't upload after that. But I just think it'll be fun to document late April because first of all, April is very kind of spring-like. It's like nice. And April is the month I was born. So it's like my birthday month. So we're doing celebrations all month and it's tax season. So <laughs> you'll get all the stress of like us filing our taxes <laughs> and just all the spring goodness. So I'm going to make the today's sort of house hanging with me video the first one. So I don't know when this one's going to be uploaded, but Maybe we'll get two videos in one day, I don't know. Anyway, I'm gonna get to work now. I've enjoyed hanging with you for the last few weeks, I guess. Little snippets in my life. And um, I'll see you very soon. I really need to make some tea right now. I am feeling a little bit like I need some caffeine. All right, I love you. Bye.